Hello everyone, this is Tamiko with Chatham Property Maintenance located in Savannah, Georgia. Today I wanted to take the time to go over our landscaping website. Um, we just launched this website a few months ago. I think it was about October 2016. And um, I just wanted to take the time to go over some features of it. It's basically all of our websites are going to come with the same platform that we when you maneuver from one website to the other. For instance, if you leave uh, nationwidepropertymaintenance.com, which is our base website, provides um, a lot of information on our handyman services and um, landscaping, pressure washing, tree removal, painting, just a unlimited list of property maintenance services. But um, we've, uh, we do quite a, this is one of our, top um, services we provide. So we felt the need to separate it and give those clients a kind of a base. And being that landscaping is such a broad industry, we wanted to also give you something to where you, when you come to landscaping.nationwidepropertymaintenance.com that you're, you're already in that field. Um, so here you'll see basically it's going to be the same layout like i said before of course this site you'll see a lot of improvements over the time over the next um year and year or so um you'll notice us making a lot of changes on it but we just wanted to give you guys a base to work with and um be able to find those solutions you need for your property Basically, the whole site is set up and operational. Um, we're still adding pages to it, um, trying to daily, but of course that doesn't happen all the time. We still have to get out and work, but um, a lot of stuff we're doing, trying to just improve the industry, give you guys what you want, make our um, your experience with us as pleasurable as possible and keep you coming back. And to see that we're able to provide you with whatever you need without a drop in service. Um, it's kind of hard to understand that and let um, customers know that that's one of our main thing is, you know, once you get to hearing that someone provides the amount of services that we do, you become leery and think, OK, is the quality going to drop or are they just doing something? But once you go to browsing these sites, looking at our photos, looking at our work, this is all done by us. Um, actually, even if you take a look at some of our older photos, you can tell the difference with the photos because you'll be able to see the quality quality of the pictures. And most of these pictures are taken with a cell phone while we are working. Not, most of them aren't staged. So... Um, this is work done by somebody in Savannah. And um, like I said, we're just trying to build a reputation of high quality, high end services. And also we don't, um, we want to make it affordable. So um, just take a look, browse around the website. Um, like I said, everything is pretty much all the pages are put together. This is a, uh, job we did and um, a hardscaping job we've actually done quite a bit of work on this job um we've built the fence built the outdoor shower installed the patio pavers um installed the irrigation system correction modified the irrigation system just a vast majority of work we've done here. We stained the um, concrete outdoor um, patio and um, just providing unlimited amount of services to the homeowner, commercial, and commercial clients. Here's a, um, another landscaping job we did over in the Ber Berwick area of Savannah. Um, Berwick Plantation. This is a job we did over in um, Kensington Park area where we installed a patio. Um, and these, we're on, of course, the hardscaping side. I didn't mention that when I was clicking on it. 
but right here you can see we're actually in the horror escapes and retaining walls um, here's a little unique I love this design um, we need these all over Savannah this is uh, an area to store the trash can and all that um, this is another landscaping job we did we did the front and backyard lawn on this one this is a job we did in the Arsley Park area pretty extensive job um and we're as we build this website we're gonna be able to take you guys through the process of um our initial contact you know you'll get to see every picture of the before the after and just walk you guys through the transition of a property and kind of give you a time frame on how long it's taking us to complete these jobs, which is a big factor to uh, the homeowner, of course, because when you go to getting into big landscape projects, we um, we do a lot of work. It looks bad before it looks good. So, um, basically, that's that's all I wanted to go on with this. But as you can see, you got your drainage solution, your pine straw and mulch installation, sod installation, which is another big service um, we provide. Um, of course, we rank pretty high on Google for that. So we get a lot of calls for sod installation. The sales save 40% off. Um, you know, we provide Centipede, St. Augustine, Zorza. This is a recent side um, installation photos. This should take you where well, it takes you nowhere. But um, we'll go back in and fix that. Now to take you to our um, Google Plus photos, and you'll be able to see a bunch of our installation jobs. These are recent posts. Um, on this one, we're talking about using landscape rocks. Well, these are actually boulders landscape skate boulders in your um landscape this is a job where we um installed rip wrap um rocks in the plant beds so this client um we haven't heard from him since we we used to do his pine straw every year around the, um october time frame but um he wanted something that was a little more permanent it's a little you know it's a little harder more industrial look for me um but it looks good it works it serves what he wanted and we're able to give um give he hasn't um called and needed any mulch and he never will it'll be there those rocks will be there uh, as long as the house is there so um and uh, another factor with that with um you know our jobs you come with the idea our job is to provide you the pros and cons of your idea and like i told him this would work because his hedges and shrubs were mature and he wasn't um into planting any um perennials or um seasonal colors so it works for him but for some homeowner who likes to plant different colors, you know, we would have to come up with a, we could do this, but we would have to use flower pots and stuff that, in order to give you that color. Oh, that boy's good. I'm about to get all kinds of sale.